Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel Easy Peasy Vocab. Today we are going to talk about perfect verb tenses. Present perfect, past perfect and future perfect. Basically there are 12 verb tenses. Simple present, simple past and simple future. We have talked about present, past and future in the basic tenses video and you can watch that in my playlist. The next comes perfect, present perfect, past perfect and future perfect. Progressive continuous, progressive or continuous, present progressive, past progressive or future progressive. The last one is perfect progressive or continuous, present perfect progressive, past perfect progressive, future perfect progressive. Today we are going to talk about the perfect verb tenses. We are going to talk about the other tenses in the next upcoming videos. Perfect tenses show action that is, was or will be completed by some designated time, either in the present, past or the future. There are three perfect tenses, present perfect, past perfect and future perfect. Let's see the first one, present perfect tense. It tells about something that happened or that started in the past but it is ongoing in the present. If the helping verb has or have is used, the verb phrase is in present perfect tense. The present perfect tense of a verb consists of the helping verb have or has followed by the past participle of the main verb. Let's see some examples. If it is singular, I have collected, you have collected, he, she or it has collected. If it is a plural form, we have collected, you have collected, they have collected. Let's see some examples of the present perfect tenses. In the first image you see a girl. In the second image what do you see? You see some jewelry, right? Sheila has collected African jewelry for years. So in the sentence above, Sheila began to collect African jewelry at some time in the past and she still collects it. That means that event has took place in the past and it's still ongoing in the present. That is why this is present perfect tense. In this, the third image, what do you see? You see a boy and there's a phone, right? So what do you think has happened? The boy says, I have lost my phone. In the sentence above, the boy's name is Tim. Tim losing his phone just happened in the recent past and it still has its effect in the present as he's thinking about that event. So this boy is thinking about his lost phone. That is why this sentence is in present tense. The second one is past perfect tense. It names an action that happened before another action or event in the past. If the helping verb had is used, the verb phrase is in past perfect tense. The past perfect tense of a verb consists of the helping verb had followed by the past participle of the main verb. So in singular form, you can say I had started, you had started, he, she or it had started. And in the plural form, we say we had started, you had started or they had started. If you have any doubts on the helping verb, you can look at my video called auxiliary verbs or helping verbs so that you can get a better understanding of what a helping verb is. Now let's see some examples of past perfect tenses. So in the first image you see a girl again and the second image you see some coins, right? Before her last birthday, Sheila had collected only coins. So in the sentence above, Sheila started and finished collecting coins 
before another event that also occurred in the past her last birthday so she finished collecting coins before that event her last birthday right so this is past perfect tense in the second in the last image what do you see you see a boy in a movie theater right he is sitting with popcorn james had seen this movie once before he watched it yesterday so in the sentence above james already watched the movie once in the past before another event that also occurred in the past that is yesterday so james watched the movie yesterday so yesterday is past right before that there was another event because he already watched this movie once so this is past perfect tense got it then is the future perfect tense it names an action that will be completed at some point in the future if the helping verb will have is used the verb phrase is in future perfect tense the future perfect tense of a verb consists of the helping verb will have followed by the past participle of the main verb in the image what do you see you see somebody is preparing for exams right you see final exam you will have finished your final exam by this time next week that means by this time you are telling the particular time by this time next week you will have finished your final exam so this is in future perfect tense as we are talking about the time here note when there is a helping verb it is the helping verb not the main verb that determines the tense of the verb phrase so the tense of the verb phrase is determined by the helping verb and not the main verb the helping verbs has and have are used for present perfect tense the helping verb had is used for past perfect tense and the helping verb will have is used for future perfect tense exercise so now, now let's identify the verb tense morocco has exported fish and minerals has exported so this verb tense would be present perfect in the year 1711 moroccans invaded spain what do you notice in the sentence you don't see a helping verb there is only one main verb which is invaded and it is the is in the past tense because you have an ed right so it is the past tense the moroccans had left many influences in spain had left so this verb tense would be past perfect craft workers have handed down their skills have handed so this verb tense is present perfect most moroccans speak arabic here also you don't have a helping verb and you have only one main verb which is speak and speak is present tense right what is the past tense of speak spoke so this verb tense would be present tense the parade will have ended by the time louis gets out of bed will have ended so this is future perfect we will come and see you next week we will come so we are talking about the future so this verb tense would be future thank you so much for watching please do like share comment and subscribe for more videos thank you so much